What are the post-pandemic workplace trends going to be? Many of the workplace changes that occurred as a result of the pandemic have changed the workforce for the better. But which of these changes are here to stay? In this video, we'll cover the top seven trends that will continue even as the pandemic comes to a close. Hi, I'm Jacqueline from Jobform. Let's begin. In the last 50 years or so, there have been some notable changes in the working world. More women have joined the workforce, more workers are supporting fewer children, and the types of skills in demand have shifted dramatically. Today, as we look towards a post-pandemic future, even more changes seem to be in sight following the avalanche of adaptations that have been made since March of 2020. While some of those changes would have happened eventually, this worldwide experience has been the sole cause of others. While these changes might feel overwhelming at times, it's important to remember that you don't have to address them all at once. You can prioritize changes to meet employee needs and business objectives, focusing on the right plan for you and your company. That being said, here are the top seven post-pandemic workplace trends you should expect to see, and that will begin to affect where, how, and why you work. The first post-pandemic trend is probably the most obvious, and it is that remote work will continue, often in the form of a hybrid workplace. Before the pandemic, remote work was a small slice of the workforce, but the pandemic proved that it was possible for many employees to work from home and remain productive. Some research even shows that almost half of all employees will work from home, at least part-time. Transitioning from full to part-time remote work will require a lot of adjustments like policy changes, new scheduling structures, safely shared offices, collaboration tools, and creative team building. The second trend is that the workforce will go global. A perk of remote work is that it allows you to hire staff from anywhere in the world, which is great for hiring top talent that may not live in your area. A workforce that is spread out does have some challenges, as it can often lead to isolation among employees and difficulties with communication. However, by using the right tools, you can overcome these challenges. You would have the ability to serve a much wider audience if you have national or international operations. Another trend will be the continued debate over location-based pay rates. As a result of the increased work flexibility, some employees are leaving expensive urban areas for regions that are more affordable. With this comes a debate of whether or not those employees should continue to receive their higher location-based pay, or if the new pay standards should only affect new hires. There is no easy answer. Therefore, experts feel that the issue will continue to go back and forth for the foreseeable future. The fourth prediction is that employee well-being will remain a priority. Unsurprisingly, the pandemic increased concerns about employee health and wellness, and this concern will likely persist post-pandemic. This is partially due to the fact that outdated management strategies have been replaced with flexibility and empowerment, which, in turn, has caused higher productivity and improved retention. Simply put, happier employees create happier customers, which leads to better business overall. The fifth trend is the continuation of employee monitoring. It's been reported that 16% of employers have been using monitoring tools in employee computers, email, and chat to ensure that everyone remains focused, regardless of their location. This post-pandemic workplace trend is expected to continue as human resource departments begin to use monitoring as a way to collect health and safety information as well. However, if you do choose to use any monitoring technologies in your business, you should be sure to follow certain measures to protect employee privacy so that you don't find yourself in a lawsuit. The sixth trend is transparency translating to success. For many businesses, the pandemic instigated increased transparency from management, and it seems that transparency is here to stay. You could even argue that transparency will likely increase as Gen Z joins the workforce. Ultimately, employers that are radically transparent and those that support other progressive ideals are most likely to succeed in the post-pandemic era. Lastly, flexible work will continue to be an option following the pandemic. Flexible and freelance work has been particularly successful throughout the pandemic. Some employers are replacing full-time employees with freelance ones to save costs, but others are hiring freelancers to scale their businesses. There's even the possibility of new freelance-adjacent models remaining like talent sharing. 
This occurs when one sector is impacted and its employees apply their skills to another until their industry regains its momentum. Whichever type of business you run, you'll be better prepared for the future if you keep these predictions in mind. That's it. Those are the seven trends that are here to stay in the post-pandemic landscape. Let's take one more look at them before we sign off. The workplace trends you should expect to continue post-pandemic are remote and hybrid work, the global reach of the workforce, the debate over location-based pay, employee well-being as a priority, employee monitoring, transparency in management, and flexible work. Thank you so much for joining us today. I'm Jacqueline from Jotform. See you later.